Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I hope you enjoyed those lip swatches of the new e.l.f. liquid matte lipsticks. So when I received these in the mail, they're actually like a lot um, bigger than I thought they would be. I feel like they have a little bit more product. I don't know if maybe just, they're just weighted, so they don't feel cheap. This like These feel really nice. These are only $5. So I picked up all five of the new colors. Hopefully they'll release more. Maybe they're just kind of testing out with these five colors kind of playing it safe um and then hopefully they'll come out with some more colors but five lipsticks for $25 liquid lipsticks um yes I think you whereas maybe one liquid lipstick is anywhere from like 20 to 25 dollars and I really like these and can soon I could see myself probably loving these for the price and the quality I was impressed I think elf did a great job when I saw they released them I was like I don't know I don't know these could go good these could go bad but I really like these I feel like I swatched all colors and none of them were like streaky they're very lightweight um, but you don't have to add so many swipes just to get pigmentation it's like lightweight instant pigmentation you can kind of build it up it doesn't kind of clump all over your lips it dries really fast it definitely is a matte no transfer proof lipstick um i would say depending what you're doing like any liquid lipstick um i if you eat it's definitely gonna kind of go away in the center of your mouth um you can probably get away with these maybe like five six hours without having to reapply maybe like six or more depending if you're not eating or anything but i don't know who goes six or more hours without eating <laughs> um but you won't have to reapply and um you can feel it when applying on your lips it's not super dry you can definitely like any matte liquid lips you can get the feeling of like a matte lipstick on your lips but i feel like as i wear i kind of forget that i'm wearing it on my lips you know like it's not too heavy it's not over drying it's not like killing and shriveling my lips up <laughs> and dehydrating them so much so i'm really excited for like nude colors to wear them day to day from work and this color that i'm wearing on my lips i love it so much this one is a wine tour beautiful berry color um these uh, the colors are pretty similar to the what is it the matte lip pencils matte lip color so these that come in the kind of roll-up tube these are three dollars and i love these as well so you'll see some similar colors like praline and i want to say like tea rose or blush um I forgot what color it was um, so if you liked these, but you want it kind of like in a, a liquid lipstick form, $3, $5, um, you can't go wrong. $3, $5, you can't go wrong, but I love these. I'm glad that e.l.f. jumped on the liquid lipstick trend. I'll link the review and demo of the matte lip color swatches that I did down below. In case you want to save a little bit of money, but for $5. Honestly, if you buy out five colors, you get five colors for $25. Like, for the price, I fucks with it. I would definitely recommend these if you want a liquid lipstick on a budget. And especially if you want to experiment with some liquid lipsticks. I picked up mine on the e.l.f. website. Um, I haven't seen them in store yet. But I would definitely check out your local Target, Walgreens, um, even 7-Eleven. <laughs> wherever they sell e.l.f. liquid lipsticks or e.l.f. products. Hopefully they have these soon. I am really impressed by e.l.f. I really hope that they expand and have more colors because these are so affordable. Especially, maybe hopefully they get some more like vampy colors for the fall that's coming up. But these are pretty like safe ones where like honestly I feel like almost pretty much any color you get you'll like. Just to kind of give you guys like a quick difference in the colors. So the first color that I had on just for the nudes if you're wondering like these all look the same to me. But they have different like tones undertones to them so depending on your preference so the first one is blushing rose i think this will look really nice it's kind of like a dusty rose with like a hint of brown it's not too cool tones like a neutral like rosy type color and then when you get to tea rose this one is more of a cool tone color so this one has a cool tone pink so you can kind of tell the difference next to each other because I know people are like, these look the same, but to the trained eye, they do not. They have different undertones. And then the last color, Praline. This is definitely like a warmer nude with more of like a peach to it. So that's Praline down here. So if you can kind of tell the difference, all of these I really like just depends on your preference of color. So if you want something a little more neutral, a little more cool, and then a little bit warm on the peachy side. And then between the two pinks, 
just so you guys can kind of see the difference. This one, Berry Sorbet. This pink, this is definitely more of like on the magenta pink side. So it's a little bit more of a brighty pink. Really nice for all year round if you want to like a pop of pink for the summer. And then the one that I'm wearing on my lips, as you can kind of see right here, this is definitely more wine tour. This definitely has more berry to it. So it's a little bit deeper. Got more of the purples going on there. So you can kind of see wine tour. So you can kind of see the difference in the color. Just a quick swatch for you guys to check out. So I was definitely impressed by these. If you picked up any of these, let me know how you liked it. And if you're going to pick up any of these, let me know what you guys think. I hope they come out with some more colors. Like if they come out with more colors, I would definitely pick them up within a heartbeat just to swatch them for you guys and just to have them for myself. Something very affordable, whether you want it for yourself or if you want to like gift them to like a friend, a family member, a little makeup beginner, kind of start the little bundle so they can experiment with colors. I hope you guys enjoyed this review and demo of these new liquid lipsticks and I hope you guys go out and get them. I hope they don't sell out. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.